two news stories now, starting with an effort to promote accessible health care and bodily autonomy. KTV News Watch 7's Maddie Augustine was there tonight as the Women's Fund of Omaha launches a new option for emergency contraception. <laughs> a groundbreaking moment. We believe this is the first public space for emergency contraception in our country. It's the second emergency contraception vending machine in the metro, launched by the Women's Fund of Omaha. We're just trying to remove barriers for people and also increase access. The first opened just under a month ago at Nebraska AIDS Project in Benson. Already without any promotion, we're already seeing dozens of, of people who have purchased the products. Now the second inside Night Owl in Blackstone. We were on board immediately. We felt very comfortable with this initiative and we absolutely wanted to support it. The vending machine allows those in need to purchase emergency contraception for only $8 or a pregnancy test for just $3. We think it's really important to make sure that people have the information they need and resources for the products that they need. Its accessibility, Joe Giles, executive director of Women's Fund of Omaha, says is more important than ever. Particularly in the landscape where we see abortion care as being more restricted, where we see lawmakers threatening to ban birth control. Giles says they know the unexpected happens, so these machines offer a completely private and affordable option for preventative birth control. It's something Katie Mock, owner of Night Owl, says she's proud to be a part of. I know that access can be challenging for young folks especially, and I do hope that our peers in the industry follow suit and decide to do something similar. To learn more, visit omahawomensfund.org. Maddie Augustine, KETV, Newswatch 7.